Both the Bood and the Kalahari Red Goats are prominent meat breeds with their own unique characteristics, but they share some similarities due to their common origin in South Africa. In this video, we discuss some key differences between the Bood and the Kalahari Red. If you want all the information discussed in this video as an infographic, we will add a link to your free copy in the description. Let's get started. The Bood Goat was developed in the early 20th century through a combination of indigenous African goats and European breeds by Dutch settlers in South Africa. The Kalahari Red, on the other hand, originated from the arid regions of the Kalahari Desert, also in South Africa. It was developed through selective breeding of indigenous goats and red or brown goats of Indian and Pakistani origin. You can immediately tell the Bood Goat and the Kalahari Red apart from one another by looking at the colour of their coats. The Boods are predominantly white with a red or brown head and some white patches on the body. The Kalahari Red Goats are characterised by their distinct reddish-brown coloration, which helps them blend into their desert environment. There's also a distinctive size difference between the two goats. Brood goats are large, muscular animals with a well-developed body frame. They have a short, smooth coat and prominent ears, often with twisted backward pointing horns. Comparatively, the Kalahari Reds are a bit smaller. They are medium to large size with a strong, well-muscled body. They also have a relatively short coat and may or may not have horns. While brood goats are adaptable and can thrive in various environments, they are not specifically adapted to arid conditions like the Kalahari Reds. The Kalahari Reds are well known for their adaptability to hot and arid climates, making them particularly suited for regions with limited vegetation and water. This is usually the defining quality that allows a farmer to choose whether or not the Bood Goat or the Kalahari Red will be best for them. Bood Goats are renowned for their rapid growth rate and high feed conversion efficiency, making them highly suitable for meat production. The Kalahari Reds are also raised primarily for meat production, and they are known for producing lean, well-marbled meat with a desirable flavour and texture. When it comes to reproductive capabilities, the brood goats are known for their reproductive efficiency, and they often produce multiple kids per birthing cycle. Similar to the broods, the Kalahari Reds also exhibit good reproductive traits, including high fertility and the ability to produce multiple offspring. Both goats are often used in breeding programs. Brood genetics have been widely used to improve meat production traits in various goat breeds through crossbreeding. Similarly, the Kalahari Reds have contributed to genetic diversity and sustainability in arid regions, aiding in the development of hardy meat goat populations. In terms of worldwide distribution, brood goats have been exported to many countries and have gained popularity worldwide. While less widespread than brood goats, Kalahari Reds have also been exported to various countries, especially those with similar arid climates. Now, if you have had any experience with either the brood, the Kalahari Red, or even both goats, we would love to read about your experiences in the comments. Before you go, remember to download your copy of our free infographic, and we will see you in the next video.